What is going on guys, DBG here and today we are going to be talking about NBA 2K20 on my team season 7 which is coming tomorrow. We are going to be talking about the developer blog which is going to be talking about more, well more so than anything it's going to be talking about the season. So before we get on to it a huge huge shout out to 2K UK the UK section, UK and Ireland section of 2K for sending this on a little bit early. Huge, huge thank you to them. But we are going to be going over the entirety of my team season seven. So we saw the four rings thing. And I made a complete, complete guess at that earlier. And I was going to release a video, but I can't now. We did see the tweet. I did not read this. They're going to think I leaked something. I did not read this before making the tweet. I did not read this. I just, that is just a guess. That is just a guess, guess from me. But, um, it's very easy to put two and two together. But it's time to go all in my team. This new and unique season will have you earn your way at level four your own pace. Release brand new challenges, rewards, and so much more. Are you ready to go full throttle? It's only, wait, level four your own pace? It's only four weeks, season seven, be the quickest mining season. Thank you! Thank you, Duque! It's a very intense time here at NBA regular season. End the playing tournament, start the playoffs. Basketball Hall of Fame. Okay. 150k on day one. Alright, the card's gonna be garbage. And I just re I can just see the words Vane's card without reading. Yeah, he's gonna suck. He's gonna suck. So, um... To start, we are releasing 150k XP on day one, meaning there is nothing holding you back from earning your way to level 40. Additional XP will be released throughout the season, commemorating moments. Moments! Thank you! Please actually do them. Accompanying new releases, obviously, and getting you closer and closer to season 7 level 40. I reckon it's going to be easy. Like, if there's if there's 150k to do day one, this has to be easy. This has to be easy if there's 150k to do day one. There will be... It will mean there's, there's going to be a race, because... That's, that doesn't even include the additional releases. So it means that there is going to be a legitimate race to level 40. Imagine if someone gets that in like the first three days. Then fair play to them. Accompanying Vince Sandy will be even more Dark Matter rewards cards earned here at my team. For limited, we are featuring Elgin Baylor. Okay. Okay, I'm not dissatisfied at that. I'm not going to do it. And he's Dark Matter though. If he's Dark Matter, that's something. It's actually quite good. Picking up this legend after collecting the four rings, one per weekend after wins in Unlimited this season. In Unlimited, earn Larry Johnson. Oh, lads, I'm, we're not touching Unlimited. No one's touching Unlimited again, I'm sorry. I'm sorry, nobody is touching Unlimited this season. Look for Moncrief. And he, Moncrief will be decent in the Ascension. He'll be decent. Bailey Howell and Triple Tread Online. I mean, he's a DeMar DeRozan clone. He's going to be a DeMar DeRozan that can play small forward, power forward. He's actually going to be a bigger, better build DeMar DeRozan. So he's actually going to be great. He's going to be fantastic. Bailey L. <sighs> Jerry Lucas. Bailey has triple channel line. Larry Keenan in the vault. Okay, Larry Keenan might be good. And Jerry Lucas at 1,500 wins. I mean... Did I predict that? Did I predict that? I think I did predict Jerry Lucas. I'm running one of them. Dark Matter Louis Dampier. He's a six foot tall point guard, 2K. What are you doing to us? What are you doing to us? You put a six foot tall point guard into the exchange. Just when we thought we were getting something decent for the exchange. Just when we thought we were getting something decent for the exchange. Then we have Pink Diamond, Chris Paul. And Diamond Mellow. They're both going to be garbage. They're both going to be... They're all three of them are going to be garbage, man. They're all going to be garbage, man, 2K. You were like, oh, just when you put Bobby Jones in to make us think we had a we had a good thing for the exchange. And, like, I'm making a tier list later talking about the most relevant cards from this season. And I do specifically talk about how I believe that, like, Bobby Jones was a game-changing card because of how he affected the exchange. But evidently not. And, lads, you're seeing Bill? Who could it be? Could it, is it going to be a crazy Bill on beer? Are they going to put a Bill Russell in? Is it going to be... I don't know, Bill Bradley. It's Bill Walton. It's Bill Walton. Lads. Lads, lads, lads. 
Okay, the reward market, right? Let's say, let's talk token market. As it will make its return in season seven. It's about damn time. It's about damn time. It's been four, it's been five months nearly. It's been nearly five months. It's about damn time. You nearly wait. You literally opened. You opened it twice in season three. It has been opened in one of the first six seasons. Um, as it will be open to commemorate newest inductees into the Basketball Hall of Fame. Starting Saturday, head into the token market for exclusive packs containing Hall of Fame badges. Hall of Fame badges and packs on the token market? GG's, lads. GG's. Keeping with its namesake, our Legend Edition Kobe Bryant's induction, we're giving all players a Hall of Fame badge every day for eight days straight. Hall of Fame badges are going to tank. They're going to tank. Everybody's getting eight free Hall of Fame badges. Is it? Is this to do with the market, or is it just giving us free? Log in each day to pick up a new Hall of Fame badge. Yeah, Hall of Fame badge. Half, extra half badged cards are going to tank. They really are going to tank. Like, imagine if you can pull, like, a bunch of half blinders. And you're going to be a... You're going to be a millionaire MT-wise if you can just pull a bunch of half blinders. That's mad. That is mad. So, nine Hall of Fame... Like, all eight Hall of Fame badges. That is interesting. That... Is very very interesting. Is the Hall of Fame this weekend? That would be interesting. But eight half badges, really? Speaking of long awaited returns, Spotlight Sims. Thank God. New rewards will include lifetime agendas tied to completion of some of the upcoming channels. Oh, interesting. It'll be new lifetime agendas. What will the rewards be? The final basketball card. So basically, you need to finish the basket. You need to finish Spotlight Sims to get the holographic ball. By the looks of things. And, like, I'm not going to get, like, the pink diamond or the diamond ball, so I'm just not going to get it, so I don't really care. Get ready to experience the fireball for the first time in next-gen consoles. I mean, the fireball was just off-putting. It was just off- It got banned in tournaments, like. It was just off-putting. Like, there was nothing that was more off-putting than the fireball last year. There really was nothing more off-putting than the fireball. It was literally banned. This is an intense season. It's matching the intensity we're seeing in the NBA. With teams preparing for the play-in tournament in the NBA playoffs. We're launching this season with a new current three. Called it. This set includes our first ever Opal base cards. Thank you. Hey, they're going to be ass, but they're still going to be 97 rated. I mean, it's going to nerf the odds of an Opal. Opal's got nothing now anyway. Um, you can pick up a new set of current series of League Series 3 packs of boxes or from premium releases the rest of the year. Thank you. At least we can get something half decent. And that's obviously, that means people are going to be getting on... Are people going to be getting Tatum tomorrow? Maybe. I don't think actually people are getting Tatum tomorrow. New signature challenges against Tracy McGrady. Which means Tracy McGrady is going to be the picture on the season. Um, T-Mac chose an amazing score for Flurry from 2004. Dropping 13 points in 33 seconds. Match his stat line, win a game, earn a diamond shoe, and yet another half badge. To bring it live to that next T-Mac. If you need a Tracy McGrady, yada, yada, yada. There's going to be even more going into the season daily. To stay on top of everything in Australia, it's not very important is to stay connected to Twitter and to your local community hub. With all these agendas, locker codes, season levels, it's time to go full throttle. I mean, you know what? There is one massive thing. There is one massive thing out of all of this. Like, is it the most exciting thing in the world? No. Like, literally, the whole purpose of the season. Come, like, last season, we had the codes. The season before, we had the hero cards. This season, we have finished things fast. Play a lot. Play fast. And I like it. The only thing in this entire dev blog that matters. I'm telling you. The Hall of Fame badge thing matters. Actually, the Hall of Fame thing badge matters. Great to see Spotlight Sims. But the only thing in reality that matters in this dev blog is this right here. This is the only thing that matters. This is the only thing that matters in this season. That's it. Like... We're getting a whole bunch of new cards. The mode basically resets. We're getting a whole lot of free stuff. So there's obviously going to be hype about that. But the only thing that matters in this season is that it's four weeks. That's it. That's that's realistically it. That is all that really matters this season. That is all that realistically matters. So anyway, yeah, that is pretty much it, lads. That is the video. What? Let me know what you guys think of this season. Is it going to be the most hyped thing in the world? I think the first day will be hyped. But I mean, like, we're not going to get some of the 
like comic book cards and stuff we're not gonna get the codes it's not gonna be rng fest hopefully fingers crossed but look it's four weeks so if it's good and we get a whole we get a new season and even if it's bad we have a new season in four weeks and that's the video thank you guys for watching please like comment and subscribe